Um, good morning, Bear Creek Church family. Um, for those of you who don't know me, my name is Bridget, and I'm a member here at Bear Creek. I serve on our missions team, and um, I'm also a Compassion International sponsor and advocate. Um, I personally have been sponsoring kids with compassion for the past 10 years or so. I have one child who I sponsored through completion of the program, and I currently have four other um, children that I'm currently sponsoring. For those of you who don't know, Compassion International is a holistic Christian ministry dedicated to lifting people out of poverty in Jesus' name. Um, they're best known as a child sponsorship program, um, and we as a church have done a lot of um, annual Compassion Sunday events. They do also do work with um, other aspects of ministry, including um, health care, leadership training, mother and children, um, wells, providing animals for um, income, and things like that. Um, this year, Compassion Sunday is a little bit different, obviously, since we're all um, in the pandemic. <laughs> um, usually we focus our event on child sponsorship, inviting members of the church to sponsor um, children. However, at this time, Compassion is not um, focusing on new child sponsorships because every, um, all of their efforts are going towards um, dealing with the COVID-19 virus um, across the world. Um, in general, a child living in poverty dies every five seconds. And that is without the pandemic that we have in place. Um, these children are dying from preventable causes. And now, um, COVID-19 has impacted, um, impacted these rates. People in other countries, just like in the United States, are losing their jobs, losing their access to education, and losing their access to food. Um, Compassion says that the pandemic problem is that we have parents who are already struggling, are now even less able to provide for their families. Um, if a family member is getting sick, they do not have access to the health care they need. They may not even be able to get tested, and they don't have the money to pay for the doctor, let alone any medicine that might be um, helpful to them. And parents are desperate for work, and they are losing their jobs and unable to pay rent and afford the basic necessities. So what Compassion is doing right now is focusing all its resources on um, providing the basic necessities for families um, in the countries that they serve in. So the Compassion Centers are providing um, food and or grocery vouchers for families who are currently in need and can no longer afford, afford food. Um, staff is helping family get access to medical care and to cover costs of treatment, which they normally wouldn't be able to. And they're also helping with rent and housing payments for families to be able to stay in their homes um, during this time. So our fundraising efforts this year, instead of focusing on child sponsorship, we would like to focus on um, the disaster relief provided for COVID-19. Um, Compassion, for every $80 donated, Compassion is able to provide family, a family of food for an entire month. Um, when that goes up to $110, they are able to add in nutritional supplements. When that goes up to $150, they're able to provide hygiene essentials. And when they reach $200, they're actually able to provide medical screening for COVID-19 to an entire family. So what we would like to do as a fundraising effort is uh, we would like to be able to help um, raise $1,000, which would be the monies needed for five families to provide food, nutritional supplements, hygiene essentials, and medical treatment for COVID-19. Um, our fundraising goal, like I said, is $1,000, and we're hoping to do that by June 1st. If you're interested in partnering with us to make this a reality, you can send your money to uh, make a donation online um, at our website, which is listed below on the screen. And just in the comments, list uh, Compassion International. And then you can also um, send in a check if that works better for you. But we're looking forward to putting our um, 
our beliefs into action and continuing our sponsorship of Compassion International and meeting the needs of the global community.